Hello ladies and gentlemen, you're welcome to our channel once again. Today we shall be discussing how to calculate the pressure of a pressurized closed tank. Now, calculate the pressure exerted by here P1, that is at station P1. In order to achieve a jet stream with the height of delta H23, which is 12 meter, while the height between the section 1 and 2 is H12, which is 4 meter. Assume we have a pressurized closed tank depicted and schemat schematically, and viscous loss are negligible. Once again, Calculate the pressure exerted by the air P1 in order to achieve a jet stream with the height delta H2, which is 12 meter, while the height between the section 1 and 2 is 4 meter. Assume the pressurized closed tank and the viscous loss are negligible. Today we have a pressurized tank filled with water producing jet on the right hand side due to its pressure internally. Now we are asked to calculate the pressure one that is the pressure at the station one here. So how do we go about that? By using the energy balance equation between stage one and three that is using the Bernoulli equation we have v1 v1 squared over two plus g z1 plus p1 rho one minus v3 over two minus gz3 minus p3 over rho equals zero now in order for us to use the energy balance equation, we know that the velocity of the fluid inside the tank will be zero. So that means our V1 equals zero. So that's cancel. We know that the velocity of the jet at the outside is zero. So that gives us zero. So we have our V3 equals zero. And we have our pressure at 3, which is equal to 0. Since we are dealing with stationary aerodynamics fluid. So therefore, our V1 equals 0. And our V3 equals 0. And our P3 equals 0. Now, in order for us to find the pressure at P1, how do we find the pressure at P1? Since we are given the height of 2 to 3 and we are given the height of 1 to 2. Now, how do we find the pressure 1? From our given equation, we have G H1 plus P1 over rho minus G H3 equals 0. So therefore, our P1 equals rho as the density of the water inside the tank multiplied by the acceleration due to gravity, G, multiplied by the height from 3 to I to 1. So that gives us our P1 equals rho G into bracket delta H23 minus delta H12. Don't let us forget, our P1 is what we are supposed to find. Our P, which is the density of the water inside the pressurized tank, equals 1,000 kg per meter cube. Our G, which is the acceleration due to gravity, 9.81 meter per square. Our height, the differential height, which we're given, 12 minus 4, which gives us 8 meter. So therefore, our P1, which will give us 1,000 multiplied by 9.81 multiplied by 12 minus 4 
from there we have our p1 which equals 78480 pascal so in order for us to transfer it to atmosphere pressure we divide it by 10 raised to power 5 so our calculated pressurized one equal 0 0.85 atmosphere thank you